So good morning, everyone. Today is the first day of the challenge. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Is this is your first time uh, tuning in to my channel? I want to welcome you in and welcome you to the Healthy Weight Loss Challenge. A lot of us, we have a lot of issues. I know that I do, and one of them is losing weight. Losing weight. So I did debate at first about having a weight loss challenge, but I needed something to push myself and something to challenge myself to keep going, to stay focused, and to be disciplined. I felt like a weight loss challenge was the best thing to do. And then I wanted to have it long enough so that anyone who participated, and also for myself, would have time to reach their goals and also learn during that time what it's going to take um, to make this a lifestyle and to change habits and to do the things that are going to help each and every one of us reach our goals. So that's what this weight loss challenge is about. This is a healthy weight loss challenge and you choose whatever eating plan that you want. I am going to give you a schedule to go by, a matrix, and you can adjust that any way that you like or that you need to. Um, you have to make up your mind that you really want to commit to this challenge. You have to be committed in order to see any results. You have to uh, stay focused. And when I say stay focused, you're going to fall off because, hey, I do it all the time. I've been doing this since February of 2018. And I mean, every day has not been a keto day. So know that you're going to have days that you're going to eat foods that you're not supposed to. But just start right then again back on your journey. Don't put it off until the next day, to the next week, or I'll start again next month. No, you start right then. Just stop eating what you're not supposed to eat and get back on track. So we're going to help each other stay focused. Um, when we get off, we're going to try to help each other stay accountable. Um, and also, I'm giving away merchandise during uh, this challenge to keep us motivated and everything. I started to put on my shirt this morning and wear it for this video, but I have time to do that. I do want to show you um, my merchandise up close. So these are some of the things that I will be giving away during the weight loss challenge that you see in the back. And these are just shirts to keep us motivated, to keep us inspired, to keep us disciplined, to want to do what we're doing, just to make us feel good. Here's my shirt. I'm going to wear this one the next time. And this says... Keto Granny Power. I can't wait to put it on. So this is some of the merchandise that I'll be giving away. And then some of the shirts, they just say Keto Granny Power and different things like that. I will put below where you can go and order this merchandise. Also, um, your shirts and other shirts that you can have made. Um, I also have an apron. I got a really good deal from the guy uh, who is doing these so i got an apron and i got tights and i also have some mugs that i will be giving away during the weight loss challenge it is hard to lose weight if it was easy to lose weight you wouldn't have uh, so many people struggling to do it so we're here to keep each other motivated we're here to keep each other inspired and we're here to learn discipline to do what we need to do in order to reach our goals. This is the schedule that I printed off. Now, everyone is already, like I said, if you're going to be in, you just stay below. I'm in. I'm in in the comments. So that way I know that you're participating. But this is the matrix that I printed off. And this is just something for you to go by as you are on this journey and you can print this out you can put it on your refrigerator um, somewhere in eyesight so that it can help you stay focused and and remind you of what you need to do or what what you're doing just give you something to go by also 
like today is a 20 hour fast. Now that's for me today. I'm starting with a 20 hour fast. So that means that I won't be eating till around 12 or one o'clock today. Yeah. Let me repeat that. So I'm doing a 20 hour fast myself today and I will be eating keto and I will be adding in a walk. So this guide is just going to give you a little guidance as far as um, remind you of your eating plan, whatever it is, you can cross it off, do whatever you like as far as changing this to meet your needs. And then tomorrow I'll be lifting weights. But I, whenever I'm exercising, I like to basically do an all around workout. So I'll try to lift some weights, add in some steps, uh, do a little bit of aerobics and all of that at one time. Now, one of the rules that that is that we have to exercise five days a week, five days of your choice. I choose the five days, Monday through Friday. And then sometimes, you know, I still add things in on Saturday and Sunday, which you can like add in uh, some type of activity that you can enjoy yourself. Usually is what I do for the weekends. So through the week, you can do your walking and on your treadmills or you know your gym membership if you have that a gym membership is not necessary on any weight loss challenge you can use your body for weights you can use your body to exercise with you don't need any type of equipment that you need to invest in while you are on this weight loss journey you can do whatever type of exercises that you want to do you can even exercise along with me because I will be doing that. I will be exercising and showing some videos. And if you want to join in with me, you are most certainly welcome. The more, the merrier. Um, I like to, um, let's see what else I need to talk about. So I've talked about the prizes that I will be giving away now. You can help me come up with some ideas as far as how I will be awarding um, the prizes to people. Um, I have some ideas. So all the way through this challenge, we're going to have little challenges and we're going to have little rewards that are going to keep us motivated to keep going. So that's what that's going to be about. Like I have some mugs and different things. And those are things that I want to um, give to people to keep them motivated, to keep them inspired to what their goal is. Now for this first week, we're just going to focus on setting a goal. Each one of us needs to focus on setting a goal that we want to accomplish this week. And put it below the video in the comments so that we'll all know and we can keep each other motivated. Um, if it's to stop eating sugar, I think I mentioned this earlier in another video, if it is to walk more, um, Whatever it is, if it's to do a meal prep, whatever it is, focus on that for this week. Um, we're going to learn to change habits. We're going to learn to replace them with better habits. We're here to make lifestyle changes that are going to be healthy for us. And those of us who want to lose weight, we're going to lose some weight during this time period. Also, I felt like it was good to extend um, the weight loss challenge so that it encompasses and includes the holidays that are coming up. Holidays are where people really fall off, but we're going to be here to motivate each other. We're going to share recipes. I'm going to share keto recipes that I use um, to get through the holidays. I'm going to share recipes that I use just to get through every day. If you have recipes that you use and you want to share them, be sure and post them, um, you know, or, you know, if you're in the Facebook group, you can join my Facebook group. That information is um, below the video here also. And then also, um, when you get there, participate. Be sure that you participate. Post. Um, put pictures of dishes that you're making because we want to show each other what we are eating. We all don't eat alike. Okay, so let's show each other the different meals that we are having so that we can learn, you know, the different foods. I learned a lot about keto and the different foods to eat by just joining a lot of different groups and seeing what people were making in those groups and different things that they were eating and um, reading the comments and their opinions. And these things helped me a great deal. 
Before I go any further, I do want to say that I am not a doctor or any type of medical practitioner. I'm just someone who has done the ketogenic diet and has had great success with it. So this is why I am sharing this information with you through experience because I know that it does work. And also, um, I got so interested in keto that I did go and become a certified keto coach. So I am a certified keto coach, but I like to just learn about keto. I like to share what I learn and I like to help others. So make sure that you weigh in, make sure that you weigh in. You want to know what you start off at because you want to know what you're ending at. So make sure that you weigh in. You want to make sure that you take pictures of yourself, take as many pictures as you want from as many angles that you as you want because you know what you want to accomplish and you know what you want to achieve also take your measurements take your measurements and put them um, so that you can keep track of the inches that you also lose while we're doing this journey sometimes your scale is not going to move but you can lose inches okay your body can still be transforming and reshaping and all of these things, and that scale won't move. So if you decide that you want to weigh every day, just know that weight fluctuates every day by the type of lifestyle that you're eating, by the foods that you're eating, by the amount of stress that you have in your life, your weight will fluctuate. So don't get upset if you're weighing every day. I myself am going to weigh weekly, um, just to make sure that my scale is going in the right direction. Um, some may even choose to weigh monthly. Some may choose to weigh at the beginning of the challenge and then at the end of the challenge. But whatever you choose, um, make sure that you get a good scale, have a good scale. And what I like to tell people also before you start any weight loss journey, if you haven't, um, you know, been used to exercising or, you know, eating right, make sure that you check with your doctor to make sure that, um, this is going to agree with you, especially if you're on medications. Okay, let's see. Anything else I want to cover this morning because I am so excited to get started. Today is going to be my meal prep day. And when I start preparing my meals, I'm going to share that with you. Meal preps are important if you use them. Meal preps will help you get um, stay focused on the foods that you're eating. Meal preps will help you um, beat hunger. And I say that because you may come in and you want something to eat right away. If you can open up your refrigerator and find something in there that you like to eat and that's already made, then you should be okay. You just take that out the refrigerator and have that to eat. Now, I myself do a lot of repetitive eating on keto and that just means you know I'll make something and I'll have it for several meals I may have it the next day and then I'm also a person who eats a lot of leftovers so I'll make sure that all of those things are gone before I add in another dish for my meal prep I like to make two or three different meats and maybe at least one to two vegetables and have those available in the refrigerator sometimes if if because I have a sweet tooth, if I have some cravings, I will try to have something available um, to satisfy those. Right now, I use a lot of the Ramondo's sugar free jello, and that really helps me and fills in as far as for my sweet tooth, or it just makes me feel like I'm having a little treat or a little something special. So, I add that in to um, my uh, Eating is part of my eating plan. So if you have foods that you like now and you need to replace them, go ahead and start looking at the recipes um, that you can use or if you need help replacing some of the foods that you use listed below the video and I'll help or anyone who, you know, is uh, in the challenge or wants to offer information, we will gladly, gladly accept it. And I want you to get the word out. Let people know that this is a weight loss challenge that they can join in. And this is from September the 1st through December the 31st. Four months, four months of helping each other to be our best 
and to do our best and to stay focused. We're going to build our self-esteem. We are going to do really, really great, and we're going to reach our goals. I, are you as excited as I am? I hope you are because I am so excited. My scale has been moving, so I wanted to keep going in that direction, and I want George to go in that direction, too. Along the way, we're going to have um, a lot of little events that are going to um, just keep us, you know, focused on what we need to do. So if you put uh, below the video that you're in, um, figure out what your goal is or what the one thing that you want to focus on for the week. And you can put that below the video. Um, I'm so excited that you have decided to join in and to participate, and we're going to learn and do so much on this weight loss challenge. I have already weighed in. I'm getting ready to do my measurements again, so today will be me updating my measurements, and um, let's get started. Bye-bye. I will. Oh, I do want to mention that once a week. We will, I'll do a live and we will talk about what, um, what's going on with each of us. Um, you can give suggestions, share recipes, and I mean, just really, really discuss how we are doing. Below this video, because I'm trying to decide if a Wednesday night would be a good night, wait, a Monday night or a Friday night. So let me know which one you think is best below this video and also i'll probably do a poll because i want to make sure it's at a time that i hold a live that you can participate so i'd like to get some ideas so that i can come up with a good time that's viable for all of us and anyway if i do a live i will also it's released as a video so you will still have that information available Let's see. So, we are ready and we are going to do this, okay? We're ready and we're going to do this. We're going to be successful. And I want to say I am so glad that you are here. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure that you hit that subscribe button. Um, Give me a thumbs up, a like if you like this type of a video, if you're interested in this challenge, if you think it's a good challenge. Also, comment below and participate. Participation is key. I want to say I'm so glad that you are here. And let's do this, you guys. Let's go. Yay!